Disney finally succeeded in making a Pixar movie. Big Hero 6 tells the story of a boy named Hiro, H-I-R-O. Brilliant inventor and, like so many brilliant people, is completely bored with normal life. His older brother, Tadashi, actually encourages him to apply to the technical school that he goes to. Nerd school, as Hero calls it. <laughs> Big Hero 6 takes a look at some very serious topics. Hero's brother, Tadashi, dies, and we see him grieve and, and feel that loss through him. Now, Hiro, he finds Baymax. Baymax is the last creation of his older brother, Tadashi. We see Hiro go through the grieving process and find refuge in a group of friends and kind of come back, pull himself back from a dark spot. And it's, it's a really good visual to see. It's a really good story to tell. And it's very impactful. The basic premise is something that we've seen before, but the way that it's told is, it's actually really well done this time. This movie has a very big message of be yourself. Don't let anybody else change you. Be who you are and, and be proud of who you are. And it's a really good message, I think, for, for a movie like this. And it's a really good message overall for kids to be seeing. Take pride in the fact that you're a nerd. Take pride in the fact that you love technology. Enjoy it. Be who you are. The animation in this movie is fantastic. Disney talks about how they use a new technique called path tracing. It's some advanced form of ray tracing. Tracks light bundles and how they reflect. And what we get is a nearly photorealistic environment. Definite standout in this movie is Baymax. I am not fast. <laughs> Big Hero 6 is, is genuinely laugh out loud funny. There were multiple times where, where I actually found myself laughing. It's a very humorous movie. It's also a very serious movie. Big Hero 6 won the Academy Award this year for Best Animated Film from 2014. This is a movie that appeals not just to kids but also to adults. I'm I'm a grown adult, I enjoyed the movie. My nine-year-old son really enjoyed the movie. The villain in this movie is actually pretty well fleshed out. More sympathetic character than I think most villains in children's movies are. You find out later on he's somebody who's dealing with very similar issues. A lot of grief, a lot of loss over losing somebody who's very close to him. Now, of course, if you follow the plot closely, you can kind of figure out who it is as you're going. That didn't really take away from it for me. <laughs> Overall, Big Hero 6 is a very, very well-made movie. It's a lot of fun, deals with some pretty serious issues. Good for kids, good for adults. Some of the heavier issues might be a bit much for younger kids. Maybe, you know, six or seven and under might not get all of the movie. There's a lot of action and it, it should keep everybody involved. Um, but older kids, definitely, it, it's a very good movie. They'll, they'll see it, they'll get it, they'll understand it. It's a good buy. I have it. It's right up here. <laughs> I'll be back tomorrow with a discussion of the Deadpool trailer once that's released this evening. Thanks for watching. Like if you like, and if you want to see my videos when they come out, hit subscribe so you'll get notified.